Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. I'm Purple from Game here and today I'm playing some more Bloom, not Blooms, Peglin. I'm playing some more Peglin. Hello game, there we go. Um, so I seem to be having a bit of an issue right now with my mouse, but ignore that. Uh, so hopefully this video is gonna work. Um, I did a lot of testing. This is a different screen recorder than I'm using for today's video. So hopefully the video quality at the very least should be hopefully significantly better than it was last time. Uh, I'm mostly nervous about the game audio. I did some testing and I had some issues with it, but I'm not quite sure what's gonna actually happen. Uh, but I really like this game, so I want to try it at least one more shot. There's a chance you won't be watching this, but if you aren't watching this, then what I'm saying is meaningless, so I don't care. Uh, so I'm gonna be trying this recording. If the audio is a little bad, I apologize. It, I might still post it if it's like something minimal, and if you do hear it, I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't really know how to fix it. I'm just, in case you guys are curious, I'm using uh, Xbox Game Bar to record this. Uh, which I found the video quality was much better than most things, but the audio is very subpar. And I don't know what's causing it, it's just weird, like, staticky sound in the background. But it doesn't even s seem to scale with volume, so I may end up doing something weird and doing a lot of volume, like, changes to try to get this to work. I don't know. I'm gonna try this out, hope it's gonna work. We are back in Peglin. Peglin is an awesome game. Not too, too many of you guys watched the first one, but I'm hoping I'll do a better thumbnail, better job on this one, you guys will watch this. Because I think this is a really fun game and would love to turn this into a mini-series. Uh, for a quick recap on last time, uh, just I'll put a link to the original video in the description. Definitely take a look at it. Um, what else? Not Honestly, not a lot else. We're into the second world now. Uh, I can take a look at the map. It's a little weird. I don't really know what direction I want to go. Map weird. I have to do, like, a middle mouse in order to actually, like, left click, which is very weird. Okay, M. Boom. That works. That's why you have hotkeys. Uh, so we definitely want to go left. Okay, just, that's good to know. That's all I need to know for now. So I did technically try this stage a couple times, so I actually know what this stage is, so it's not as much of a surprise for me. But as you can see, we got four enemies here. We got a sword, a sword and shield, um, a, an archer person. Can, can I click on this? I can't. An archer person and a mage. The archer person and the mage are a range attack, so they suck. If I take turns, they do a lot of damage. This knight dude in front with his shield, his shield also has 200 health, I think, and it takes 0.5 times damage, and it takes all frontal damage that's not piercing or, like, falls from the sky. So, Ice Circle, which I actually start with now, is really awesome. And during one of my tests for audio, I was playing through this level, uh, I one-shotted the entire thing in a single shot using this, so... I'm gonna try to do that again. I don't know if it's gonna happen, but I'm definitely gonna try to do it. Involves a little bit of timing here, though, so let's see. I, that did not work out as well as I was hoping it would. So no critical hit. I'm probably not gonna one-shot everything this time. In fact, only 66 damage. Uh, which actually gets stopped by the shield. Okay. So this shield on me is really annoying, and I am taking some range damage, like 7 per turn, which is a fair bit. Uh, I also do, thankfully, have the, uh, what's it called? Obelisk up now, so hopefully we'll be able to get the shield enemy out of here. Oh no, that was so bad. Like, so ridiculously bad. This really sucks. Uh, so there's a small chance I'll lose this, because this is currently going very, very poorly. Which sucks, but that's just, like, what's happening right now. Which is really too bad. Uh, oh, and of course you missed the critical head again. Oh, so we did get it there, that's good. Otherwise this weapon's, like, utterly useless. At least now it has some use. Can I get one of these crits? No, or bombs rather? No, doesn't look like it. This stage is brutal. I'm gonna die. <laughs> like, so bad. Like, so quickly, honestly. Uh, I'm not loving my chances right now, but let's give it a shot. This is really bothering me that I feel weird clicking thing. Uh, hopefully it has no impact on you very much, but it's really bothering me, and I'm doing a bad job with these hits. I don't like it. Yeah, times 0.5. So we kill the shield now, but we're doing so badly. <laughs> Um, I do have one, like, relic, I guess, that gives me, what is it? Actually, do I, uh, I'll take the crit still. Uh, that gives me, I believe it is, uh, guaranteed critical hits if I'm under 30% health, so that might be useful. I'm doing such a bad job right now. Like, such a bad job. Are we back with Ice Circle? We are, okay. So, luckily we have a good crit here, which is awesome. Uh, that could be a big deal if I get this to work. See, this is messing up my aim a bit, which is bad. But there we go. Did get the critical hit. We need a lot of hits here, because if we do 200 damage, we one-shot everything. And we just did 200 damage because we got a bomb, and plus we actually did 200 damage. So if I did this from the start, uh, prepare to see everything be one-shotted. Yeah, so that would have happened last time if I had played this a bit better. 
Uh, but I didn't, so yay, that sucks. Okay, let's choose a new orb. Uh, Dark Orb, I'm definitely tempted to steal this. Deals no damage, heals you for each pick it, permanently removed from your deck after it is used. So it's just like one free heal, essentially. Darks, uh, Darkness Ethereal, blind enemies have a 35% chance to miss one attack. Uh, probably the Darkness Eternal, the rest of these kind of suck. Though actually my stones are way stronger than these, so... I'm gonna choose stone, honestly. I could heal, I will need to heal eventually, but I didn't use quite 50% health, so I'm gonna take this for the time being. Uh, and I said I want to go left, right, M? Yeah, left. Well, double left should take me to the treasure chest, which is awesome. Uh, okay, so yeah, that's pretty good. Hopefully this recording is going well. I know I mentioned that already, but I'm gonna say it again. I really do love this game, and I had to give this one more shot as a video to see your guys' response and see if I could get it better quality uh, before I gave up and played on my own. Great! More movement things! Yay! So there is a critical hit here. Boom! No, that missed. I missed that timing horribly. Uh, we did get a bomb, maybe, though? Two bombs? I'm so confused. This is hurting my brain so badly. Okay, we did... We did a decent amount of damage to that dude in front, which is great, because the shield on me suck. Uh, we're using a stone level one. Let's just go for the bombs. I have so many bombs here. Let's just go for a bomb. I said, let's just go for a bomb. There we go. One bomb. Uh... Maybe two? I think we got two, and now three, actually. So three bombs, that's pretty great. That's sort of what I wanted. I think four bombs. Okay, that may have been overkill, but four bombs, I'll take it. That kills everything. Uh, so that could have been worse. Now there's just a single enemy left who's going to shoot me with the bow. Yeah, of course. Uh, I certainly could use some more healing right now, but I think I'll probably be okay for the most part. Wait for this stone to go, and crit. Awesome. Can I finish this dude off? Hopefully I did just get the refresh, which is probably a pretty big deal for that. Uh, I need 134 damage. I'm pretty close. I'm over 100 now. Are we good? Are we gonna get it? There we go. So, enemy defeated. Now, just finish off. Yeah. Awesome. So, we're gonna get a new relic after this, too. Okay. Uh, could take the swelter again. That one's pretty decent. Uh, Memo of deals initial 0.34 damage for each pet hit this battle. Can target enemy, uh, enemy on screen. Can only be used once per battle. Um, I'm gonna take the Memo because I think the Memo can be very powerful. We'll take a heal next time, I think, is what I'm gonna do. So we have a special treasure chest here, which is awesome. And then I'm gonna go for a heal next battle, because we definitely do need a heal. But I'm willing to wait a little bit longer, because my healing also gets stronger with each, like, orb I get, which is really cool. So I'll take the double battles on the left, and then the one on... So I'll go left next time. Uh, let's take a look. What is our chest going to be? Uh, tactical treat. Um, refresh move after every shot. That's... I think that's a good thing. I don't know. Um... I'm gonna say good thing. I don't know if that's that good or if that's only mediocre, but it's something. There were definitely better items I could have gone there, but that could have been worse, so I'll stick with it for the time being. Uh, let's take a look on this next battle. Hopefully it'll be easy because obviously I'm not in a great situation. Okay, a bunch of wall enemies. Looks like they just have a ton of health, but I don't know. Let's, let's see what I can do with this. Um, shoot, shoot, shoot. There we go. Okay, that was weird. Uh, that was all my mouse just used again. Oh, and we hit the bomb. Awesome. So this actually looks like it's going really well. Doing a ton of damage. Uh, we have at least one bomb. Potentially two now. Yeah, double bombs. That's 100 damage dealt to everything. These enemies have a ton of health, and then we're gonna one-shot one of them. So, unfortunately, I'm gonna one-shot the weakened ones, which kind of sucks, but that's still pretty good. I wish I had the one that did, like, overkill damage, but I don't currently have that. So these guys just move really far really quickly. So that's... Well, that's definitely not great, but that could be worse. And we did land that crit again. I was hoping I had that time guard, which I did, thankfully. Uh, that was pretty awesome. So I only really want 211 damage. Since I don't get any bombs, I'm okay with that, and I have no overkill, so I'm good with that. Uh, as long as I'm one turning one of them each turn, I am set. Like, I have no issue with that. Uh, we do now have double ice circle, which is awesome now that all enemies are on screen. But we don't really have an easy crit, so I'm just gonna go here. Because I don't know, like, there's isn't really a great option here. I just really want as many balls as possible now. So 138, not bad damage to everyone. Only two! Oh, right, only crits pierce everyone! Okay, yeah, no, so I definitely need to get a critical hit with that one. I'm almost under the 30% threshold, which means my pierce, everything's a critical hit. But I'm not there yet, so currently I still need to try. Which means I need to get this timing right, so I'm just gonna try to shoot every time. There we go! Oh, come on! Did I really miss that crit? Oh, there. Okay, cool. Got the crit. Awesome. That was necessary. Uh, 203 damage to everything. That's awesome. Those are both really weak, and they're not gonna hit me quite yet. Though they are gonna attack me next turn, so if I could get double bomb, that would be awesome. Though I don't know if it's doable. I also still am not quite sure how I'm clicking right now, but I'm doing something, and that's working, so good enough for me for now. So we're definitely one-shotting this next one. 
Uh, so I can do this. Like 108 damage I should easily be able to do next turn. So I have no real issue with this. Even if I'm only using a level 1 stone, 108 damage really ain't that much. Uh, like I already did. I'm about to do it. Plus I might get a bomb as well. So yeah, awesome. We're good. Uh, you can roll off into nothingness now. There we go. Stone, good job. Uh, so that went pretty well. Oh, upgrade an orb though. I really need the health, don't I? But I'm not losing very much health per game anymore. I'm gonna play at risky and go for the upgrade. I'm gonna go for the upgrade. I really should heal. I'm gonna heal soon, okay? I promise. Uh, Memor, what do you get? You get a fairly decent damage boost, the Memor. So the Memor is like a super kill card, which is pretty decent. Uh, I'm gonna say, let's take a look at something else. Do you have something else that might be better? I don't think so, so yeah, I'm just gonna go Memor. I think that makes the most sense, so I'll take that. Um, so there we go, uh, we only really have one option right now, so might as well go for it. I don't have a healing one, like, if I hit something off camera, right? No sufferings thing is a bunch of stones, nothing special here. Uh, I don't think so, I think I'm good. Cool, just had to double check that. Okay, next battle, I'm definitely gonna take the heal. This is the last thing. I have 39 health, so I should still be okay, that's a good amount of health. Uh, I should make it into my guaranteed crits here, which is gonna be fairly helpful. That's a good, like, last resort when I'm under 30% health. Uh, but hopefully I'll be okay here. I hope so. I do want to actually quickly double check the map, because I haven't looked at it in a bit. Also, this stage looks brutal. I'm regretting my choices. Uh, so this shield into Mega Boss. We want to go all right for a little bit now. Sounds good. Uh, I don't like this. There's lots of enemies here, and multiple of them have shields. I mean, there's a lot of orbs on this map, which is awesome, and this is so laggy for me. I, I can only imagine how this looks to you. I think it's because of the sheer number of projectiles and orbs and stuff. But my screen is so laggy right now. Still, we did finish off the shield of me, so that's pretty good. Uh, looks like these people are weird, these ones in the grass. Also, this person in the back is a mage, so they can also uh, heal, do some weird healing thing, which I don't like. So that kind of sucks. Can we get 400 damage here? I heavily doubt it. Uh, so I don't think we're going to be killing this dude. Maybe at best damaging his shield, killing his shield, but nah. That sucks. Okay. I really hate these shield enemies. They cause me so many problems. Oh! The knights teleport. Okay, that's that's good to know. I'm not liking this right now. And I missed that refresh barely. That sucks. Okay, um, yeah, I'm really not liking this run very much. I still didn't get those refreshes. Missed them all. There we go. Got that one. Um, at least we did finish off the enemy, so that's something. The one that teleported in front, so we didn't take any melee damage yet. I'll take the refresh again, honestly. Actually, no, this is the one that we need the crit. I can go for the crit here, I think. Can I go for the crit here? I actually don't know if I can go for the crit here. Let's try it. Did that go for the crit? I have no idea. This is actually kind of nice, though, right at the edge. We did get the critical hit. Awesome. So we actually are doing at least half decent damage here. That's something. Nothing incredible, but that is something. His shield's destroyed. Not that it really matters, because I'm so far behind and I'm taking so much damage. Upgrade orb. Awesome. You are still pretty decent for the crit, but I do have a stone next. Nah, I need to fill this person off. This really sucks. I'm not having a good run here. Also, I guarantee crits anyways. So that was dumb and pointless, but whatever. Uh, with this, we have a decent upgrade, so refreshes are definitely going to be better from now on. But we couldn't even finish off the enemy, and I'm, <laughs> I'm doing so badly. Okay, well, let's give it a shot still. Maybe we can do something decent. Probably not, but maybe. So let's find out. How well is this going to go? I don't think it's going to go very well. We have the guaranteed crit, so I don't know why I even bother doing the weird thing there. Um, it's good damage, like, we're definitely gonna kill this dude in front, which is decent, but we're still... Still not great. Because we're still getting sniped by the wizard person, so we still are very much so not in a great position here. I'll take that for the time being. I, this guaranteed crit is definitely helpful. That's a very helpful skill. I'd love a refresh right now, that'd be very useful, but that looks like it's gonna happen. Uh, we may or may not be able to finish this dude off, though. 336 damage, are we good? No, we are not. So it does look like if we finish off his shield, he also dies, but I'm down to 9 health here, which is terrible. Refresh time! I missed it again! Okay, there we go, thankfully. That was so brutal, I'm like, come on, we're so close here, this shouldn't be this difficult. Uh, this dude definitely should be dead. No, he's not, of course, I just destroyed his shield. I'm down to 2 health. I'm not liking this. There's a part of me that feels like I should try to exit out of this. I can sort of be cheeky and try to, like, cheat. Because if I don't kill him- no, I'm dead, so... I'm gonna do a bit of a cheeky thing and exit out of the game. Return to main menu. Because if I do this, I can reset the battle. It's a bit of a cheat, and I'm sure they're gonna do something to counteract this later on. Like, maybe add a negative to it or something. But I'm gonna try this. 
because I don't really feel like losing right now, so I'd rather try that stage again, because we came into it with a decent chance. I want to at least give it a shot. I'm not doing a very good job. I'm slowing this game down so slowly, making such little progress. If I had just taken the heal earlier, none of this would have happened, but of course, I'm greedy. I will say, I haven't gotten my men more once. I know my party, like my deck, is filled with a bunch of orbs, but even still, that feels kind of cheap. Uh, terrible crit spot sounds about right. Only a single bomb. Yeah, this map kind of sucks. Like, it's not awful, but it's definitely not good. It doesn't have the best stuff. Uh, we did 93 damage with the dagger. That kind of sucks. That's almost useless. We got teleport people, which is decent. I need a good icicle thing, or honestly, even the obelisk here is pretty decent if I can get a crit. But I don't know if I'll be able to do that. Like, it's definitely not an easy thing to do. Oh, that was not what I wanted to do in the slightest. But hey, it might work. There is a crit down there, so there's a chance. Yeah, there we go. 400 damage. He's definitely dead. So that was decent. Uh, that could have been better, but that's definitely not bad. And then we have these sword enemies in front, which are going to be nice because they'll tank for me for a little bit. Uh, only a little bit, but still, every little bit counts. Uh, can I go for this bomb slash refresh? Maybe. I don't know. I'm just going to go for it down the middle. Let's see what what's the worst that can happen. That is not what I'm trying to do not liking this. We did get a crit though, so we did definitely kill this dude, which is awesome. Too bad we couldn't get that refresh there. Sounds decent. That could have been worse. But we have a shield on me in front and I have nothing good to kill him. Like, nothing good to kill him with in the slightest. Um... I'm gonna take this, because I'm gonna get guaranteed crits anyway, so if I can get that crit there, which I did do awesome. And we did the refresh. That was good, but only 108 damage still. He's still gonna wreck us. So much damage. Do have uh, one more turn. So we have this normal stone, but then we have double icicle. So we're in a good situation. If I can get this refresh, that would be great. Not that that many are missing, but even still, uh, it would be nice. I don't think we'll be able to do much damage to this dude. We're doing good damage, but it's just the dude has his shield is insane. He just does so much damage to me, it's almost impossible to kill him. Uh, so now I'm hoping basically our double icicle orb is going to be awesome. So. Just go for the orbs, it's critical already, we just need to hit as many things as possible, is basically all the goal is. Uh, which generally isn't that hard of a thing to do on a map like this. We should be able to one-shot everything with this, we should have just won. And I think we did, awesome. Uh, so, I mean, these are all good, Bramble's really awesome, and Splat Orb's not been pretty decent, and Boulder Orb even is pretty good. But I really need the heal, so heal please. Uh, that was much needed. So we're going alright again, if I double check. Uh, yeah, all right after this one, or at least most of these choices are just straight up straight paths. Uh, hopefully I won't end up in the fire, that's really the only bad thing that can happen here, but I did not, which is awesome. I'm actually liking this, this is going pretty good so far, ignoring the tiny bit of cheating I had to do there, hopefully I won't have to do that again. But I don't feel like losing the run, because this is a good run and I actually want to make it to world 3. There's a world 3, this is brutal. Great, two plant enemies and two enemies with 777 health. What better thing in existence is there than this? Are these worlds mirrored? They're mirrored. Oh. That's cool. Okay, so we get like double everything for this. This is really awesome. Put in my head a little bit, but it's really awesome and it's letting me do a ton of damage. Like a ton of damage. Not to mention pretty much everything has been upgraded at least once. And we did double- What the heck? This is so overpowered. Okay, never mind. Maybe the stage isn't that difficult at all. This is so cool, though. Uh, we didn't even get the crit. This is our drag orb without crit, and we're doing, like, what, 500 damage? 600 damage? And we're gonna get the crit. How did we miss that crit? But even still, 404 damage. Wow. I'm assuming once we kill the shield enemy, this stuff goes away? But I don't actually know, because currently this is so absurd. Like, we're so ridiculous. So ridiculous, because everything times two damage to the shield. Oh, but it gets reflected back at us. Okay. So if we didn't kill it, which I did that second time, it's really bad. How did I miss that critical hit? That's really annoying. This is actually going really bad this turn. Yeah, that really sucked. Okay, because then he does damage back to me. Or, yeah. Okay, so this is an iffy one. Definitely an iffy one. But this is going pretty well overall, so I'd say I'm probably good for the most part. I'd really like a refresh, but that doesn't seem to be happening anytime soon, so that sucks. Uh, we did get a bomb, so hopefully we can finish this dude off at least. Looks to be the case, I think. Yeah, awesome, cool. It's a weird enemy to shield, but I do like it. Uh, just crit, crit. There we go, critical hit, refresh, he's dead. We're gonna do like a thousand damage this turn, I just know it. This is really cool, I like this. It's weird, but I like it. I, I don't know, I'm definitely nervous, because I don't know if we're gonna do all that great of a job right now. 
I feel like we're not doing all that great of a job right now, which I don't like. Uh, okay, so options are Echo Orb, which I don't love. Like, that's really not that great. Um, Man Orb again, which is decent, but I only got to use it once. I'm just gonna take the heal. Heal back to full. I don't like my options all that much, so I'd rather heal up and have, like, I guess almost like a guaranteed choice when I actually get something I really want. That was not intended in the slightest, but there we go. We're okay still. That was a little nerve-wracking. <laughs> Uh, my goal for today is to beat the entire second chapter. Hopefully it's going to happen, but we're going to have to wait and see, I guess. Uh, do we have some more basic enemies here, or is this something new? Looks to be more basic enemies. Okay, that's not bad. Uh, should be able to get a crit here if I time this right. I did not time that right in the slightest. Uh, a bunch of shield enemies. Wonderful. They're my favorite, obviously. We do have a level 3 icicle, though, which is awesome. I need to get this critical hit. Oh, but they move, right. How do I do this? I just, I got everything surrounding it. Oh, there we go. Okay, got the crit. Because we're going to say, like, I got literally everything surrounding that. Except the actual thing I wanted. And now, I have a sex, bleh, successfully killed them all. I love that advice. I circle so helpful right now. Uh, now, honestly, I don't care that much. I'll take whatever I can get. As long as I can do 200 damage, which isn't that difficult, I'll be happy. Preferably, I'd get a crit to guarantee that 200 damage, but nope, we're still good. Awesome. Just the mage left. Uh, that heal was pretty well worth it, I say, considering I didn't use it at all. Uh, that sounds it's definitely worth it. And now we're going for our upgrade orb, of course. That makes sense. All that's gonna happen is we're gonna get zapped by lightning, which sucks, but it's not that bad. Uh, we can't go for the bomb this time, so at least we have a chance here. Except I messed up my timing, because my clicks are weird, which makes timing very difficult. Did I just- I did 77 damage. That sucks. 1 HP enemies. I think it happened last time too, and I got like an achievement for it. I don't care if I get an achievement for it, it still sucks. It's still annoying. Uh, upgrade an orb, definitely. Uh, I probably the memorb again, because I don't like many of these. Because uh, most of their upgrades kind of suck. Okay, I need to get this clicking out of control. Um, no, this really sucks. You can target enemy, enemy on screen. Uh, oh, okay, so now I can be used multiple times for battle. Okay, so then never mind. That's pretty decent. That's a pretty solid boost. Plus, it gets a bit of a stat boost anyways. Uh, definitely treasure chest, right? Oh, okay. No, so I want to go right, right, right. Okay, cool. I just made sure. Had to make sure there. Uh, definitely all right still. And I ended up in the fire. That sounds about right. Only did two damage, so it could have been worse. If I end up in the fire again... Okay, great. I just, I did not do a good job. Then two damage ain't that bad, though. I thought it would be way worse, so I'm kind of happy with that. I'm going into a boss after this, so my health's good, but it's not max, which isn't the best. What's the question mark going to be? You find what looks like Haglin standing motionless on your path. Who's Haglin? That's some distant re relative or something? Uh, something about it gives you the creeps, but they seem to be offering the same services as usual. What do you desire? Upgrade an orb, remove an orb. Uh, I'd rather upgrade an orb than remove an orb, thank you, but I don't want to do any if it costs me seven health. Um, oh, can I say nothing? So never mind, I don't really want to upgrade an orb. My orbs kind of suck. As far as removing an orb goes... I mean, a stone's an option, but I'd probably rather remove the drag orb. Stones are generally better, so I'm gonna say drag orb. You get removed. I said remove. There we go. Consider it done. You're less than thrilled with the price that was paid by your satchel is lighter with the removal of drag orb level one. That is true. My satchel is lighter. It still sucks though, uh, and I still didn't. I'm still not pleased with that in the slightest. But there we go. Chest into boss fight. Please give me a good relic. I'd really love the one that makes damage carry over. That's awesome. I don't think it's going to happen, but that would be very awesome. Let's take a look. If this sucks, I may not go for the boss. It's not mandatory, so this is an iffy one. All attacks hit plus one, plus one. That's pretty helpful, all things considered. That's a pretty nice boost. Like, that's just a straight-up damage boost. There's no reason not to want that. I'll go for the boss. It's the risky play, but I'm still at, like, almost 90 health, so I think I'll probably be okay for this. I'm definitely a little nervous, so like definitely more than a little nervous. Uh, especially since we're going into the final boss soon too. I almost completely forgot that even existed, uh, which is probably a bad thing. Okay, so so maybe it's just me. I know there is like a boss here. I guess. Can I see his stats? I don't think so. Nah, no, it doesn't look like it. Oh, I did not mean to shoot the rock there. That was not intentional, but 
I have a dagger coming next, and I was gonna use my easy crit, and I got a crit anyway, so I guess... I don't know, that was fine, I guess. Nothing really all that bad came from that. Uh, I just don't like using that orb. Okay, come on. I'm gonna get my memo soon, level 3, which is decent. Um, I don't like this, though. I'm taking a ton of damage, leading the boss. So there's the... No, that's not the boss. <laughs> not even the boss. Um, I'm not loving this situation currently. Let me critical hit. Let me just shoot the ball. I'm having so many issues right now. There we go. Okay. I don't know why everything's going so weird for me. Uh, there's crit. Uh, we're doing a bad job. Like, we're doing very little damage. We're not even killing, gonna kill a shield, I don't think. Uh, and I'm going back with a normal ice, normal rock ball. So, we're going into the boss this time. This could be worse. Okay, I can't even see his health, which kind of sucks. That would have been a nice thing to see. I really just want a refresh. Honestly, that's what I want here. If at all doable. I want a refresh. That's it. I want to time this well to get a refresh, because my next orb is the ice orb, which is the one I really want all this stuff, good stuff for. So just let me fire. There we go. Awesome. Got the refresh. Go away. Awesome. Exactly what I want to happen. Take a ton of damage, which sucks. But hey, at least now we get our critical ice orb, or ice orb, rather, which can be super helpful, right? Oh, right. These spots move. I knew that, but it still sucks. Okay. Am I gonna shoot through these? There we go. I'm gonna try to do that. Uh, can we get the crit here? That would be awesome, except we didn't get the critical hit, which sucks, which means we only pierce one enemy and don't even do enough damage to kill them. I don't like this at all. <laughs> this isn't going well. We have our man orb next. Very powerful, does a lot of damage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I get it, I get it, I get it. I understand. I understand. I understand it. I can target any enemy. Yes, that's awesome. Cool. I did not mean to click. Get whatever. I have my guaranteed crits right now. It's actually kind of sucks. Which sucks, but at least we killed one enemy, so that's something. Am I gonna see the boss's health at least? How much health? It's gonna have like a thousand health. 600 health. That's actually way less than I expected it would. Like significantly, significantly less. Uh, whatever. I should- I uh, easily killed off this enemy. I'm gonna die to the archers. Is this the point where I once again do my cheesy thing and reset the boss? I'm so dead. Honestly, whether it be cheese or not, I'm gonna do this one more time. Just because I, I did such a bad job. This boss play has not been good or optimal at all. And I found this is a feature. I can do this, so... Ignoring my issue with not being able to click a squat, which is killing me, I hate this. Uh, we can play again, so that's- that's something. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna need to figure this stuff out. So we- we- yeah, we have two bosses after this, and then- or two battles, and then the boss. Like, the main boss. <laughs> this is not going well. Uh, I need to play better this time around, that's for sure. I need to get luckier, too. Um, ice circles are all the way at the bottom, so I did not get luckier. <laughs> Actually, no, I won Icicle next turn. Okay, so... I don't know. I don't really want to do squat with this, but I suppose I probably should get the crit. Well, I have the option to. That definitely still makes the most sense. Albeit, it kind of sucks to do it here. I would have rather used it for the other one. I believe crits reset each, like, turn anyway, so it doesn't matter that much. Uh, I do really want that Ice Circle. Ice Circle's really important. I need to do a good job with it. So let's take a look. What's it gonna be? Because uh, if I do a good job with Ice Circle, I can kill all of this, which is a big deal. Uh, but I probably won't do as good as I want to. But there is an easy crit here. Which I did get. So now we just need to hit- we need 200 damage is what I really want. We really want 200 damage. We're not gonna get 200 damage, are we? No. 156 though, not bad. That kills the mate and does a lot of damage to everything, which is decent. Uh, it could be better, obviously, but that is pretty decent. I need like 70 damage to get this thing to work, which... I might have. I don't know. I don't think I do, but I definitely could. I think I finally figured out how I'm gonna click, so that's better. Again, has nothing to do with the game. It's just me bad mouse stuff. Uh, but looks like we're good. 222 damage. We should definitely kill this dude in front. The shield's a separate target. Of course it is. That sounds about right. That sounds perfectly right. Whatever. Uh, bomb, yes. If I get this, this kills so much stuff. Okay, there we go. Instantaneously, we're all set. Uh, the only thing that doesn't have that is more than 50 health is these, like, last two enemies in the back, and then the, like, mage coming up. Everything's about to die. That is so key, that bomb right there. 
I needed that really badly. This boss actually looks really easy though, though it looks like he moves really fast. But even still, it doesn't look that bad. I have a ton of bonus damage now with the Memorb. I'm not feeling all that bad anymore. <laughs> see, like, you can really see the difference between a restart, like, a bit of better luck and a bit of strategy now. And I'm doing way better. Like, way, way better. Can I get the crit? I can get the crit. 200 damage. This boss is going down. Like, that's a lot of damage. I will say this memo ain't as good as I thought it was. I don't know why they felt it had to be, like, can only be used once, but okay. Uh, Obelisk time. There's a ton of damage there if I can get a crit. I did not know my obelisks were that powerful, but evidently they are. We did get the crit, so yeah, boss is definitely dead, which is awesome. Uh, it's probably for the best to have him one shot. He wasn't that big of an issue. My only real issue was just the normal enemies, but I have another obelisk here, so once again, pretty absurd damage. Uh, if given the option between like upgrades and stuff, I'll probably take heal just to want to play the safe. Uh, since I lose a ton of health here, looks like I will be able to kill this archer at the very least though, and then the mage obviously I won't be able to kill, but that's whatever. 500 damage! Gotta be kidding me, I couldn't have done this on a time, on a better time. I couldn't have had carryover damage, really. I really want that hammer, the hammer that lets you like damage carryover between enemies. I want it so badly, because it's gonna be so helpful for me. I just know it. Uh, we have a guaranteed crits now, so that's decent I guess. See, that, that part of me makes me think, hey, I can probably survive a normal battle without this. If I have guaranteed crits, that's very helpful. Depends where my legendary is. I don't get my legendary yet. Reorganizer. Shuffles blank every five picks it. Shuffles blank when orb is discarded. That's pretty helpful. Refresh orb. Re the refresh the board every time six pegs are hit. Uh, that can just let you stack like infinite. Ball of lightning's not great. Um, I'm going to go ahead and say... Reorganizer. I'm playing it risky, but I feel like I can get away with it for the time being. What are my options? Ring of Reuse. All hopes at plus one persist. Orbs with persist um, can be used X times to the level times each before the next orb is selected. Dis or discarding this orb will skip all remaining persist levels. So basically, I get to use every orb twice. This sounds completely useless, isn't it? Is that just me? That doesn't, really doesn't sound very good. Faint conspicuous rings. Bouncers contribute to damage. Bouncers aren't that helpful, but they're better than whatever whatever I, nonsense I just got offered in the other one. Hey, every single orb gets plus one. It can be used twice. How is that ever a good thing? There was like a curse or something that gave me like double all my orbs. So how on earth is that a, meant to be a positive? Uh, do we have one more battle after this? We do. So I'm gonna probably go for the heal after this, unless this battle is super easy. Um, I don't have Icicle for a while, which sucks, but I do have a de decent amount of turns until this dude in front actually makes progress. Um, let's see if I can get a bunch of bombs. That would be my best case scenario, is if I can get a bunch of bombs here, because I really don't think I'll be able to do enough damage to really cause any issues with him. I mean, I'm doing a lot of damage, but his shield has 400 health. I did 320 damage, that's not enough to kill it. Which is sad and crazy, but it's the case. Which sucks. Um, might as well take the refresh. This orb's insane. It's gonna do a ton of damage. It might actually kill this dude if it weren't for the fact that actually no, he this can this can attack him through the shield. So yeah, definitely do dead. Uh, Obelisk very helpful. And this dude only has 200 health plus the randomizer thing. So I actually am feeling pretty good all of a uh, all, all of a sudden. Yes, there we go. No, why is this doing this? So many mouse issues throughout this entire video. For a game that requires a fair bit of mouse precision, and that sucked. That was so bad. That could have been pretty decent, and I very much so messed that up, which kind of sucks. Uh, what are you gonna do, though? We are getting kind of close to the icicles, so that's decent. Uh, that's something pretty good. One more refresh, which could be worse, uh, and another one again. Uh, we're just not getting very many hits. I really need to aim more center. Uh, cause this dude, I could have done a lot of damage with him, and if I can kill him next turn, that's a big deal. Uh, I should be able to get 84 damage pretty easily, but I seem to be struggling to do so quite a bit. Uh, can I get in? No, it doesn't look like it. This really sucks. 68 damage, he's still alive by a tiny bit. And it looks like I might actually die, which really sucks. This could have gone so much better. This is another one where I'm like, if I could retry this, I'd do so much better. Uh, I don't think we're actually gonna straight up lose this time around, though. Uh, since I am so close to my Icicle Orb, I think I'll be okay. I really do need that one pretty quickly, though. Let's see, though, maybe I can get, like, a triple bomb here is a pretty big deal as well. Uh, doesn't look like it. No, no, definitely doesn't look like it. Still, though, decent amount of damage. That was something. Except it obviously means nothing because 
He's got a shield up, because of course he does. I hate this so much. Oh, and of course we hit it off the edge again and get stuck in the corner doing no damage. I'm not liking this battle. Okay, is this another one I reset? This is. Oh, but I have Ice Circle. Okay, I'll give this one shot. But unless I kill them, like, straight away with this, which is definitely possible, but not likely. Unless I do 200 damage with this Icicle, which I just did. Okay, so never mind. It sucks, but Icicle is my savior. My big RNG in this game is just, do I have Icicle? I uh, definitely need the heal, though. Preferably, I'd actually take the heal in this next one as well, since we're going into a final boss. I feel like that would probably be a wise choice. I'm gonna try to do this. Can I go straight down? No, you're gonna send me into the fire? Nope, okay. So yeah, assuming I take... Uh, a little over 13 damage, I'll probably go heal again on this fight. Uh, just so I'm at full health going into the boss, or close to full health going into the boss. Because I'm currently still missing a fair bit of health, so hopefully this stage will be pretty easy. I don't know if I'm confident in that. Okay, just a lot of shield on these. Icicle's my second ball. Okay, awesome. That is a big deal. I need the Icicle, it's really important that I get it. And, uh, that I do 200 damage with it. So, preferably I'd either get a refresh, or I just wouldn't do very much... Like, hit many pegs here, which is what I did. Awesome. Uh, plus, then we get a second enemy summon, so two of the shields are dead, plus two mages, because the mages really suck too, because they're ranged. Oh, and we get an instantaneous crit. This is actually going so well. Uh, we can totally get 200 damage here. This is awesome. This ice circle plays such a big deal. Like, such a big deal. And there we go. That was so perfect. Because now all these enemies are dead, and we move on to the final two, which, even though they kind of suck, I'm set. And not to mention... This is actually, dude, with my current orb and my next one, too, I can hit right past the shield. So I'm set, even regardless of this. I did 160 damage, but I got a bomb, too. So he's dead. Oh, no, this is the boss. No, it's not. I don't know what I'm saying. Uh, 150 health person. I do 17 damage per orb if I land my crit, which I did. So you're pretty much dead. Yeah, there we go. This run turned out much better than I expected to. I'm definitely going to still go for the heal. Uh, 40 health is a pretty big deal. Upgrading orb isn't all that helpful right now. So, let's go for it. Let's go into the boss fight. Um, I'm gonna hope it's a wise decision. We're gonna find out. I say hope it's a wise decision. It's my only option. I'm going into this boss fight. Uh, hopefully I can beat it. Let's see what it is. Uh, it looks kind of like a minor dude, but there's like two peppers. I don't know what they are. What's it gonna be? I mean, this map kind of feels like nighty and all, but maybe the boss is the king? It's like a... Oh, okay. It's like a catapult thing. There's a lot of enemies, and this boss has 3,000 health. I don't know if I like this very much. Um, 17 damage thing, or currently 10 without crit. Please, save me. Do everything. A lot of 50 health enemies, so I'm willing to bet once again my ice circle is going to be fairly helpful. 374 damage actually feels rather good as well. Um, okay, this is a stage where you definitely could use um, uh, some, like, overthrow damage. Or, like, go... Like, yeah, overflow damage, I think it's called. We did get a bomb, though, so that's fine. As long as we get one bomb, we're able to kill all the minions, which is a big deal. That 50 health is probably planned pretty darn well, so that we use the bomb to kill minions and then attack. Because the minions go through, which is bad, obviously, for fairly obvious reasons, I think. Uh, okay, stone level 3. Let's just give a shot do a lot of damage. 3,000 health isn't that much. I don't really know what's going to happen. I'm assuming it's, like, charges for a couple rounds and then deals a ton of damage. But I don't actually know, so I'm gonna find out eventually, I guess. Uh, doing pretty good damage, though, about 400, sort of like 500 damage, including the bomb. We're definitely doing a lot of damage to this dude, so I don't know if the big issue is just we have a tank and then there's a bunch of mini enemies, because if that's the, like, issue of the fight, this ain't all that bad, so I'm assuming something else is gonna happen, but I honestly don't really know. 100 more damage, that's something. Okay, it definitely looks like it's getting ready to attack, so I'm willing to bet something's actually going to happen now. Uh, let's see if I can get a refresh here. I wouldn't say no to that. Can I? I can. Awesome. Because I have gone through quite a few of these. Okay, I am starting to realize the weakness of my backpack being filled with balls. I have so many of these. Yeah, 30 damage attack. Okay. Oh, and it gives me confusion for a turn. I think we looked at this last time, and it looked brutal. Uh, doesn't look like it's going to be that big of an issue here, but that definitely sucks. So basically, note to self, kill this dude before it gets another slingshot at me, or, like, crossbow bolt at me. But it's already at under half health, so that shouldn't be that big of an issue. Uh, preferably this time, though, I'll be able to go for a bomb. I don't think I can go straight up, but let's give it a shot. Is straight up an option? No, it is not. Didn't think so. Because uh, I have that bomb that's already set, so if I could hit that, that would be better. Because bomb would definitely be better, because otherwise I get a wasted shot here, which looks like it's going to be the case. 
which really sucks, because then one other dude's going to go in front. Um, I can tug it, though, so I'm all set. And, in fact, I'm actually going to go straight away for the bomb this time. Just get rid of these two people in front. Uh, hopefully do a lot of damage with my obelisk that's super powerful, but nope, only 157. So we're doing decent, but not incredible. Still has over a thousand health left. My better orbs are definitely coming up near the end, especially my two ice circles are going to be a big deal. Uh, but I don't know, we're doing, we're doing okay. I don't know if I'd say we're doing well or not. Uh, it definitely looks like we will kill this boss, though, because I don't think this boss is all that challenging, all things considered. It just kind of sucks. It is attacking this turn, though. I don't think we're going to kill it this turn, so I'm pretty sure it's about to deal 30 damage to us. Uh, that doesn't feel so great in the slightest. Um, so yeah, that sucks. Okay, so definitely can't let it get another hit off. That would be really bad. Just a shoot. Awesome. That was actually pretty perfect. I can get a refresh, too. Yeah, exactly what I wanted. Um, so no, I'm feeling pretty good about this fight. I really am. But if it shoots me again, I'm obviously in a really bad situation. Um, I'll probably take heal after this, because I know now that the next wolves generally really suck. So I'll probably try to do that. Uh, this is definitely what I wanted. Now I can, like, target my ice circles on the mini ground. So this dude's gonna, this is gonna be a wasted shot, because it's gonna just target the dude in front. Uh, but my icicles, ice circle, I can do this. Okay, no, I saw it target the crit for a second. There we go. Right there. Right there. Precision shots, please work. There we go. Critical hit, hit everything. I've got a bunch of refreshes there. Tons of damage. Definitely killing his minions. How much damage can I do to him, though, is the question. I'm hoping a fair bit. Uh, 369, he's almost dead. Super weak. 99 health left. This thing already has a bonus of 146, the mem orb. I'm starting to realize this orb definitely ain't that great, though. I thought it would be way better. It's not, but it's still pretty decent, and looks like the boss is dead. I'm assuming I don't have to kill all these 50 health enemies. If I do, it would be pretty easy. Doesn't look like it. Okay. Upgrade orb. I kind of want to go for heal. Sure. Uh, Reorganizer, I feel like, is probably the better choice here, because none of these other ones are that great. Reorganizer it is. Uh, take a relic. Okay. Matryoshka shell. This is... Yeah, but attacks get minus two, minus two. So basically, I get two balls, but I take minus two damage for everything. My orbs have a ton of damage. I might go for that. Uh, glorious suffering. All attacks have minus two slash minus three, but every um, peg pop gets upgraded plus one damage. Is that permanent? Because that would be insane. I don't doubt that, though. Uh, kinetic meteorite. Every three pegs hit provides explosive force until the board is refreshed. I'm going to go with Matryoshka Shell. I feel like that's probably the best choice. I think that's definitely the best choice, actually. Okay, so castle complete. Continue. Moving on to the next area. I think that's probably going to be it for today, though. If you guys do want to see some more of this game, definitely give it a like, comment, subscribe, all that awesome stuff. Uh, and then we should be able to finish this game off in the next video, which is awesome if you guys do want to see another one of this. Um, but yeah, let's take a look at the enemies, and then I'm going to sign off, I guess. Hopefully this video did turn out well. I know I've said that a lot. If it did, though, definitely thank you all for watching. Thank you for staying to the end. Have a wonderful day, and I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye!